Namaste. Well, if you're new, or if you've been following this channel for a while, you're probably wondering, what's up with this Noli stuff? Well, we've rebanded the channel. And what it's about, in a nutshell, is a spiritual revolution to overthrow people who are wrongly putting obstacles in the path of enlightenment. What do I mean by that? Well, if you look into any path, I don't care whether it's a religion, a kind of yoga, a spiritual practice, or whatever, you will find one thing they have in common is hierarchy. There is one person who's the leader, and he's the one who knows everything, and you have to approach this person somehow or other, get their approval, or their instructions, or some secret words, <laughs> or some kind of hidden teaching, or you have to join some group and pay your dues to become a group member, whatever that takes, or you have to believe in a certain doctrine and feed that back, or you have to study so many books and stuff, I mean, it varies from group to group, from path to path, from method to method. But basically, the principle is the same. Consolidating power and charging for admission to enlightenment. Now, this is just like as dumb as a rock, as far as we're concerned. Because everybody is basically enlightened. You're conscious, right? Well, if you're conscious, you're enlightened. You just don't know it because the knowledge has been withheld from you. This is an old, old, I mean, call it a conspiracy theory if you want, but just look at every religion, every civilization, culture, government, what have you. They all put obstacles in the path of realizing who and what you really are. Just look at the educational system, for example. What a mess. By the time you go through 12 years of state-mandated schooling, you're so sick of the idea of learning anything that basically whatever you know at that point is what you know for the rest of your life. Most people do not go out of their way to check out new knowledge or to go into different disciplines or to read books, especially difficult, esoteric books, and study and practice all these things. But that's what we're being told is necessary. What if all of that is just nonsense? Let me give you an example. Back in the late 1940s and early 1950s, there was no such thing as body odor, bad breath, dandruff. I mean, these things were unheard of. Tooth decay. Huh? These things were unknown. These terms, these categories of meaning that, in other words, your body being just the way a human body is, is a problem. There's something wrong. You have to buy this product to fix it. Deodorant or some special toothpaste with some weird chemicals in it. Or, you know, dandruff shampoo or uh, blackhead removers, pimple removers, or whatever it is. These problems were created by advertising agencies and manufacturers to sell their product. You know, people used to just put oil on their hair. huh? And that's great. It works fine. Keeps it from drying out, even if you're in the sun or swimming or whatever. But, oh, no, no, we can't do that. That's too cheap. So they came up with all these fancy hair dressings, 
special shampoo conditioner, huh? You use shampoo to take the oil out of your hair. Then you have to use conditioner to put it back in. <laughs> you see, it's all unnecessary. It's all just about selling a product. And because they have control of the media, the big corporations, the advertising agencies, the television stations, newspapers, magazines, and so on, can drill this propaganda into your head and convince you that you need their products. Well, the same is true of schooling and social conditioning in general. It gives you a whole raft of problems that you're expected to solve, but you have no way to solve them. Tricky, huh? It's nice. And what that does is it makes you weak. It robs you of confidence. It diminishes your self-awareness. And it puts you at the effect of people selling a cure. Oh, you're depressed? Well, take this pill, or go to this therapy, or read this book, or watch this show, or whatever. Oh, you can't concentrate your mind because your school is so bad that it's filling you with misunderstood terms? Well, you have HD, AD, ADHD, DH, whatever it is. <laughs> Here, take this pill. huh? Oh, now you're getting too nervous? Well, take this other pill so you can sleep and on and on and on. This is all complete nonsense. There's nothing wrong with you. You are whole and complete just as you are. You just don't know it because so many greedy, selfish, self-interested people have been selling you a bunch of lies since you were knee-high to a grasshopper and deceiving you and exploiting you to gain power, prestige, influence, and of course, good old wealth. We're against this. We think it's wrong. We think you should know the truth right now about who and what you really are. And that's what we're going to cover in the Noli Knowledge Course. See you later.